this year, the clerk of the weather weighed in with a perfect day to grace the opening of the Royal Ascot meeting. In glorious sunshine, the royal carriage procession made its way up the lush green course. The Queen, fresh from her Epsom triumph with other members of her family, was carrying on a royal tradition inaugurated by Queen Anne over 240 years ago. So, to Ascot might be applied Shakespeare's lines, age cannot wither her, nor custom stale her infinite variety. And variety there certainly was in the racing, in fashion, and the weather, as a sudden storm sent the fashionably dressed company scudding for shelter. Soon, under smiling skies, the fashion parade was resumed. And, oh, they're racing. And here they come, up to the final bend, with Bobby leading the field in the Ascot Stakes amid royal encouragement. But in the punishing straight, it's a long-priced outsider, number 24, Bonamy, that races away with that 2,800-pound prize, winning by four lengths. First big race success for young apprentice Michael Hayes and for owner Mr. J.E. Wood, a right royal ascot. 